I just watched the new Star Wars The Man was it Book of Boba Fett and honestly this and The Mandalorian and all the new shows of Obi-Wan show I think Disney have finally gotten it right it took them like three <laughs> two or three two movies to, that, to, to massively mess up with but they finally understand how to push Star Wars forward Mandalorian and Book of Boba Fett they both show me that you can use the old and use the old settings and characters but update them in clever ways the sequels don't update the old characters in any new or interesting ways like look at this the emperor comes back he's the exact same character he hasn't learned any mistakes from the original trilogy it's just a dumb decision really and total totally out of place but look compare this to book of boba fett boba fett in the original trilogy is just kind of a he just does anything for money really he's just kind of an asshole he doesn't really care about anyone but in this actually show him progress as a character and it's actually really interesting and he kind of fights with the Tusken Raiders and he becomes loyal to them it's a cool progression and you kind of see how Tatooine has progressed from Return of the Jedi that's what the sequels needed most they needed actual good progression of the original movies like the new the whole conflict is just a cop. It's it's not that interesting. The first order, is just a copy of the empire. There's no real difference. I mean, they did try some interesting things with like the dark side. Last year, I'll give them that. But it just watching these the Mandalorian in this show. It just shows me how much they could have done with those movies. How much they could have done with Luke. How much more they could have had him in the movies. And how Mandalorian does Luke so well, and the new ones just kind of kill him off and make him evil. Well, I do kind of like the way they ended with him, but I wish he was in it more. It's just a shame that that's what they did, and they didn't think or plan him out clearly. But hopefully, if they can stay on this track with these new shows, and just the whole, just keep this kind of format for the movies, I think they're going to be back on top. I think they're going to be at Marvel levels for me, excitement. But you never know, maybe they'll mess it up. You never know. I'm just looking forward to next season of Mandalorian. I'm gonna miss Peter Corrado. You know, it is what it is. That's about it, guys. Goodbye. At Disney, you wait too bad. I respect you now. Goodbye.